Now we're back to CapCut and let me show you how you can add a black stroke effect to this a little bit different, just a little bit from the last video that I've made for generally colored strokes. The method that I've presented to you didn't work on black ones, but this here should. We've got a footage and then we put some text in our timeline and let me adjust that. This should be LA. So I make that Los Angeles and I pick a different font method works with any font. Just size it up here. Make sure that it's white. And then scroll down until you find the stroke. So we want to have it black. We check the box here and then click on the swatch, make it black. You can adjust the thickness below. Let me go to like 10 to 15. That should be fine. Next step is to go to media, library, and background. You should find a white background there. You may have to download it first, so there's a different icon, but once that's done, you can click on the plus sign, put it in between the text and the footage. If you can't resize that, just select it, go to speed, and adjust it right here under duration. So if you can't left click drag, just set it to, in my case, 15 seconds, so that it is as long as your footage. We've got the text, the white background, and the footage. What we now have to do is to select the text and the footage. So left click, drag, then right click and create a compound clip. Text and white backgrounds are a single element now. It's selected. I go to video basic and then I use blend, open the drop down, check the box and set the blending mode to darken. And this filters out the white colors and our black stroke is kept. I hope this video was helpful, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.